each day, I, you know, I kind of figured out the night before what we need to going to do the next day. Well, you know, sometimes things change and all of a sudden something comes up and we have to change it. But, but on a typical day like this, we, we knew we had to do the rinks. We knew we were, you know, we, we flood them and sweep them, you know, three to four times a week, depending on how much they get used. So I kind of assigned certain guys to that. Um, we had some other maintenance needs that we need to do, like hockey nets. Some of the hockey nets out here were starting to become untied and stuff. So I had a couple guys come out and pick up a couple nets and they bring them back to the shop and get them all tied up and so they're all nice and tight so we don't have no safety issues. And then we had some other stuff around the shop. I, I knew it was gonna be a little cool so I tried to keep the guys inside a little bit this morning, a couple of the guys. So we had some maintenance needs around our shop to do. Just uh, there were some trash cans that we just needed to paint and get taken care of. And uh, there was some other stuff just in within our shop that I wanted the guys to take care of. And that's kind of a typical day. You just kind of roll with it. You see what happens. Um, obviously the summer is a little bit different. You know, you get into the mowing needs and you know, that's, <laughs> that's an entirely different thing. And then all the ball field maintenance that we do, which is a lot and stuff. So, I mean, it, there's just, it, every day is just always seems like something different to do and stuff, so. Well, you could be using anywhere from, if you're plowing the street, you could be using a single axle plow to a tandem, tandem axle plow. Um, we use pickups to do a lot of the plowing cul-de-sacs. We have sidewalk machines that we do all the sidewalk with. Uh, we have backhoe, you know, different options. You know, we can, you know, use the backhoe for loading different trucks and stuff. We have tractors with snow blowers on them and different, different uh, kind of tools on them that we use, bobcats, skid loaders, um, pretty much you name it. Uh, road graders, we, we kind of use everything, whatever, whatever we have to, whatever is needed at the time. One is a street sweeper and the other one is just a water truck. And that's what we, we sweep the rinks with the, the sweeper. We've tried a lot of different ways to sweep the rinks. We've had brooms on skid loaders and different ways and we found out that the best way for us is to bring a street sweeper out and it does a good job of cleaning up the ice and we can just flood right afterwards. You know, there's a lot of different things as far as, you know, the broom, as far as the, the height you can set it at and different items like that. I mean, the new equipment, and thank goodness a lot of the new equipment is you just, you lower the brooms and they do it automatically. They go down and they set themselves automatically to whatever height they need to be. And same when, when you're backing up, say, in a street sweeper. It just automatically, the new ones automatically just bring up the broom. So you really don't have to do much. You just really, you know, just do the steering, you know, and as far as they're hydrostatic, and you're just kind of, as far as the control of them, as far how fast you go and stuff. So there's, you know, I mean, obviously you can set a few things and you need to dump the hopper in the street sweeper. You go over to the snow banks and obviously there's levers in there that, you know, you control to dump the hopper when you get enough snow built up in them and stuff. But they've really come a long way and there's, they, they're, you know, they're pretty automatic in what they do. There's just a good diversity of what you will be doing for everybody. So it's, it's, it's just fun. And I think everybody is good. We got a good group of people and uh, everybody enjoys working.